But it's Tuesday, and um, I'm still out here in these streets, you know, holding it down. So, you guys, I just left Arby's. I went to Arby's to apply because the sign says they're freaking hiring, right? It says they're hiring, guys. So, I went to apply, and I just feel like, you know what? I can keep that to myself. I'm going to just keep that to myself. And all I'm going to say is that God must have a special job for me. <laughs> he must be really, really saving me for something special. That's all I'm going to say because, wow. Wow. But I'm going back to Dollar Tree, you guys. Um, I had to get a little comb and a little brush because my hair not giving but i watched a few videos yesterday and i think i am i think i know how to like master my style now like i think so so i'm gonna try that when i get home or maybe not i don't know but i, I at least want to get the comb and stuff today and then i actually had planned to go to the library today because like i told y'all i was starting a new story and um i didn't get a chance to write yesterday so I'm thinking about going to the library to write. I think that would be a vibe, right? Yep, yep, yep. But it's raining. And I'm trying to tell y'all, like, the rain deters me so bad. Like, I could have these full-blown plans. But when I, when I learned that it's wet outside, I'm like, yuck. <laughs> I don't want no parts of it, you know? But, yeah, you guys, yesterday was a harder day for me. Just because, like, I just had a lot of... I had a lot of negative thoughts in my brain, just thoughts that did not align with God's word about my situation. And it was pissing me off to be quite frank um, because it's trying to like trump and step on my faith. And that's crazy for someone who has a gift of faith, like, you know, like the enemy's really trying right now. So yeah, I need to keep my faith up and like, use the gift that God gave me gave me to encourage myself and to really just be out here I'm bothered it's not easy though but I'm gonna try so yeah you guys I also I was gonna tell y'all something I totally forgot but yeah oh he has the charger yeah sir get your charger out the way because you backed up a little bit too far sitting in my lap the bass is crazy. <laughs> oh, he's from Jersey. Okay. All right, you guys. But I had more to say. I totally forgot. Or the Holy Spirit must have been like, nope, shut up. Because <laughs> it's not coming out right now. So, mm -hmm. but yeah. Um, I'll talk to y'all a little later. Um, I'm going to try to record the library thing. So, yeah. Um, but it was a very productive day today. Um, I didn't get to go to the library because I just got carried away. Carried away in conversation um, with God. I feel like me and God got into the meat and potatoes today for real. Like, I feel like I received some revelation. Um, but yeah, we, I'm just going to keep building on that to see where that leads or whatever. But yeah, it's been a very, very good day for me. So yeah, we'll see what what uh transpires and i'm about to go 
back to the house and it's almost dinner time my cousins are gonna be there today so it should be a good time maybe i'll get some fun footage so we'll see <music> I did my hair last night right and it was ghetto down but I'm glad I did it last night so that I could do it again today I washed it today and I redid it so because this is what I know like I have to do I have to stick to what I know because I tried something new last night it was not cute so we're just gonna stick right here <laughs> and um yeah take these little twist twists out when they're nice and dry or whatever so yeah but mm -hmm. Um, I'm about to uh, do an interview in a few minutes and then today we're gonna go to the library for y'all we're going to the library today for real and yeah I'm excited about what I don't know <laughs> but I'm excited guys so we'll see what happens I don't want to give y'all too much of me talking because what are we talking about you know so I'm gonna talk to y'all a little later or not hopefully I'm not talking at all we're we gonna see middle school is crazy middle school bro sure. y'all I hate when kids play fight it blows me so much it's so triggering like please stop all right you guys so it's Thursday and um yeah i just decided to like take it easy today and just kind of chill and stuff you know didn't do like all the stuff i've been doing every day you know and i wasn't feeling super great today so i think it was appropriately fitting i am currently on my way to go um get a soup from panera and yeah you guys um, y'all the Dollar Tree here is so nice and beautiful and I really appreciate it because I really love Dollar Tree but I stopped going to Dollar Tree just because like the store was so disgusting like the floors were nasty it was just not it was not a thing like I, I don't do nasty stores so I just stopped going to Dollar Tree so I've been going to Dollar Tree like every day and y'all I just really appreciate I can take my time to actually browse through you know because they keep their store so clean, you know. But yeah, you guys, I'm going to the city tomorrow, remember? Um, I'm going to hang out there, so that will be fun. <laughs> so I think I'm going to see y'all in the city and wrap this little day up. All right, you guys, so we're on the way to the city, right? We got a lot of dilemmas going on. So I missed my train. I missed my train and so now I have to drive to another station to try to catch this train and I might miss that one too. So, <laughs> um, it's giving chow. We're going to make it there one day. But, um, yeah, so my first train was at 1223 and there was some extreme traffic so I had to reroute myself. And now my next train is at 1258. It is like 12.30 something. Uh, I'm supposed to be there at 12.50. And, you know, I just feel like that's not a lot of push comes to, push comes to shove time. So, you know, we just got to pray about it, y'all. Because, what? <laughs> you know how, like, when you're going slow, people just beat their horns. They don't beat horns here. It's so weird. Like, in Pennsylvania or New Jersey, they don't beat horns. They just, um, they just ride you. And so I pick up what they're putting down. I'm like, okay, you know, I'll get over it. But it's just so weird. Because I'm just like, why you sit on a horn? Like, I don't want you to sit on a horn. But I promise you, that's a southern thing. They don't be, nobody has beeped a horn at me. Not one time. Like, there have been people, I've been in there. There was this whole man behind me. I was pissing him off. And um, he, he, just, he just rode me. And then he zoomed past me. He did a lot with his, you know, little hands. And he, yeah, he was frustrated, but he never blew his horn at me. And I'm like, wow, that's so crazy. So, 